authority has been given to us. Jesus says, look, I've given you authority over all the power of the enemy, and you can walk among snakes and scorpions and crush them. Nothing can hurt you. <coughs> there is nothing in this world, literally, no storm, no person, no sickness, no circumstance that can hold us down because if we stand with Jesus, we stand in authority over everything in the world around us. Just by association to the man, the son of God who runs this city and everything and everyone in it. It's the awesome thing about having a healthy faith in and a healthy fear of God. When you fear God, you don't have to fear anything else. If you don't fear God, you better fear everything else. You got to worry about the lights are going to get shut off. Oh, what if he leaves me? Because he's not writing the story. Anything could happen. It's just storms of life, bam, beating you down forever. But when we stand with him, when we hand him the pen, we don't have to worry about anything. It's over. Fear ends. So we can walk, talk, and act like the king's kids in this city because that's exactly what we are. The last conversation Jesus ever had on earth, he said, all authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth, and go, therefore, and make disciples. And we need to embrace that mission with authority so that we don't allow trivial opposition to discourage us from sharing our story, and more importantly, sharing his story and how it has affected ours. I mean, Jesus is talking about we can walk among snakes and scorpions and wolves, uh, and we're talking about uh, I, I don't know if they'll think I'm weird. I don't want to stand out from the crowd. Oh, I'm just afraid that they might, they might gossip about me or what. These petty little things that we fear. Jesus is talking about, man, you could walk among snakes and scorpions, people popping at you. If it's not in my story, it doesn't happen, period. 